Hey everybody, how's it going? Hope you're having a lovely day. So I am here in Washington, D.C., about a mile from the National Mall and the Capitol Building to speak with some farmers on Right to Repair. And one of the things that I found interesting about Washington, D.C., if any of you follow my live channel, is that there's a lot of small touches that kind of make it seem very similar to a place that I used to call home. So here we are. This is again, not far from the Washington Monument, the Holocaust Museum, a bunch of different sites. It's got a lot of people walking around. And you have this space over here, which is a retail space for lease. Now, right across the street from this retail space for lease, can you guess what there is? That's right, another retail space for lease. But wait, there's more. When you go over here and you run over to this area, you'll see that right by this enterprise rent-a-car, or what used to be an enterprise rent-a-car, the window is blocked and what you think is an enterprise rent-a-car is actually another retail space for lease. Being in better shape is great. I don't hyperventilate while running anymore. And what I've noticed is as I've been on my walk to the National Mall, every single block that I walk, there's like three or five retail spaces for lease. And I checked out a couple of them on Google Maps. Some of these places have been empty for over a year, but they don't care. So it's not just New York City that's like this. It's interesting to see that it is other cities as well. I just thought I'd point that out. I found that interesting. Anyway, I'll see you all in the next video. Bye now. Okay, this is half a block away from there. And check it out. We have another one. This used to be a restaurant. And now it appears to be dead. Okay, we're going to figure out how good the zoom on an S10e phone is right now. Because this is not on my path to work. But right over there, there is another space that says retail space for lease. And that is again right across the street. Okay, so right across the street from that space that I just showed you is another one. Over here, another giant retail space available. Capital of the United States, which is supposed to be, I don't know, the best that we have to offer. There are homeless encampments in the park because they can't figure out how to handle that problem any differently. I do wonder if it's similar to New York City where they have a homeless shelter system that costs the taxpayer $3,500 to $4,500 per homeless person per month to be housed in conditions that I've described in a video that I did last year as, as bad, if not worse, than an actual prison. Wow, this really is like New York City version two. And look, another one, right down the block from where that retail space was that I pointed out, over here. Another retail space available. Okay, we're on the next block, and this entire thing does not have a sign, but when you look inside, there's nothing going on in here. Like, it's just all empty space. Empty space. Empty space. This is a complete waste of a block. There's nothing going on. And then if you take a look over there, right across the street, what's going on over there? What do you see? But another retail space for lease. We'll see how good the S10e camera is at Zoom. My apologies if that looks like garbage. I didn't want to carry my other one around. But this is crazy. It's literally like somebody just picked up all the problems of New York City, control C, and control v them somewhere else. <laughs> So I was about to throw away my trash and what I got for lunch, so I figured I'll just walk over to the trash can. And, wow, Washington DC is just like New York City. <laughs> oh. God bless America. God bless America. See you all in the next video. Bye now.